What is that, Dad? It's a it's a phone line. It's useless. Like, nobody will use phone line anymore. Okay, let's get rid of it. Yeah, phone line. <laughs> Wi-Fi social is a phone line. Yeah, there you go. Cool. Thanks, Papa. Yeah. This is us in our new house. Just wow. So Alex is actually getting quotes for these countertops too. Dad, do you remember what they charge for them? For like the countertops? Oh, $5,000. $5,000. I actually think it was more. I think my dad's being generous. <laughs> but yeah, it was like, because we were going to get the quartz countertops and to have them come and measure and actually install, it was like $6,000 from what I remember. And then that doesn't even like include like the cuts and all that stuff from like Home Depot. And it would have taken, I think what they said that like four weeks. Yeah, it took four weeks to order. Four weeks to order. And the problem with that is like when you're doing a remodel for a home is this, you're trying to get it rent ready as soon as possible because obviously you're spending money on the mortgage. So the sooner you get places ready much faster, the more money you can make. And my dad knows all about that. He's been in real estate for how long you guys been in real estate, Papa? Uh, about all, all 25 years. 25 years? Okay. How many houses have you fixed now? Yeah. You don't know. <laughs> Probably about 25 houses. 25 houses now? Just pick our own house, that's yeah. it. You know what's crazy? It's like they, they have them and they still hire people out to do it, but my dad can pretty much do anything. It's uh, actually quite amazing. That's probably where I picked up a lot of my handyman skills from. Um, you have like a favorite house, Dad? Well, my favorite house would be the one I'm living on right now. <laughs> no, but rental real estate. Oh, uh, rental? Uh, I would say it's the one I have in uh, Boiling Spring Boyle in uh, South Carolina. Uh, what, why? What, what do you... What? I get everything what I need, and there's my storage, everything in there. Uh, uh, cause a lot of tenant need, so I could store all my toys too, in the part of it. Uh, and is that the one you're talking about good, with the, the, the shed in the back? Yeah, and have pretty good location for, I could convert that to a business if I want to. Uh, it's on a commercial area. My dad's actually talking about this really cool lot where he has this gigantic shed, and it's, it fits like, Five boats, six boats. I don't know if you want. It was six cars. Yeah, yeah, six cars, and then he also uses it for storage of like, you see all these tools. He actually, I have the best parents in the world. They uh, they brought, they, they actually drove it from South Carolina all their tools, so I didn't have to buy a bunch. So I got really lucky. Thanks, Papa. Um, and uh, so yeah, we'll, hope we could do it more. Yeah, so we're hoping to get a lot more. They already bought two duplexes like, within the past six months. Um, and I know they're still, they're kind of looking, but right now, basically we're trying to do more vacations together as a family. Um, and real estate's pretty much like the way we're able to do this. Like this year we're, we're going to Asia, we're going to the Philippines, Cambodia, and Vietnam, uh, within the next couple of weeks. And hopefully in October, we're planning to do a family trip to Alaska and maybe something in between. We just haven't thought about it yet, but that's pretty much why I like real estate. My, my parents, my dad retired within like five to 10 years, right dad? Like the real estate, once you start like buying a lot, right? Yeah, I I've been doing, living on real estate for like seven years now so far. Yeah. So and it's very great, great thing. Now I'm going to show all it back to my kid. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to do this anymore. So just one of my kid only now. If whoever kid want to do or anybody else want to do it, go ask Jeff. He's right here. All right. Thanks everyone. Bye. Thanks, Papa. Love you.